We're at the last day's racing and the first race is from Cartmel, the National Hunt. It's the Cartmel Cup handicap over two miles. One is Loxwood, Darren Thompson, American Pickers, Paul Rhodes, Chickle McHayes, Davy Robertson, Sexton Blake, Kevin Medigan, Art Patrick, Kevin Medigan, Trojan Bridge, Martin Needham, Crystal Gaze, Obi Wan, Newton Lodge, Stu Gray, and Needham Tramp, Alex Cherry, Fair Dinkum, Stu Gray, and Alpine Wound, Obi Wan. Eleven horses line up here at Cartmel. And in the rain, away they go. It's Art Patrick quickly, the leader, but been passed now by the Obi Wan horse, Old Pound Wind, and Old Pound Wind goes to the front from Sexton Blake in second. Then comes Chickle Mix Hayes for Davy Robertson, who has Fair Dinkum on his inside. Art Patrick just on that one's inside in the green colours, and maroon colours on the outside is Loxwood. Then comes American Pickers for Paul Rose with the yellow colours and the red cap. And the red colours just behind that is Trojan Bridge for Martin Needham. They're followed by the Nina Tramp for Alex Cherry, and at the back of the field we have Crystal Gaze and Newton Lodge for Obi Wan and Stu Gray. So Alpine Wind, a comfortable leader, about three lengths clear of in second Sexton Blake as a jumper next. Chickle McSays jumps up into third on the inside of Loxwood. On the rail is Art Patrick for Kevin Minigan with Fair Dinkum on his outside. They're followed by the red colours of Trojan Bridge for Martin Leatham and Danina Tramp with those orange sleeves and orange cap just behind that. Then America Pickers with the yellow colours and the red cap very close to the Obi Wan colours, followed by Newton Lodge for Stu Gray and Crystal Gates at the back of the field for Obi Wan. So it's the Obi Wan horse, Alpine Wind, who takes him along. They've jumped three fences, only got four more fences to go here yeah, in this uh, two mile Cartwell Cup handicap. He's about four, three lengths clear of Sexton Blake in second, about a length and a half back to Loxwood on the outside of Chickle McSays. They're followed by Kevin Minigan's Art Patrick, who's on the inside of the Nina Tramp. Behind that American Pickers is just on the inside of Fair Dinkum. Then comes the Trojan Bridge from Martin Needham in the back two, or still Newton Lodge and Crystal Gaze. So Alpine Wynn, still this four length advantage over in second Sexton Blake. Loxwood, just on that one's quarters. Behind them the grey horse uh, Chickle McSays for Davy Robertson. It's a two lengths further back to Art Patrick who's on the inside of Fair Dinkum. Nadina Tramp between horses. Trojan Bridges the red colours going wide. Uh, in between horses the yellow colours with the red cap jumps as well as American Pickers. Then behind that, uh, behind those is uh, Crystal Gaze and Newton Lodge still the trailer. So less than a mile to go yeah and Alpine won the leader from in second Sexton Blake. Chickle McSays moving forward for Davy Robertson with Loxwood on his outside. Then American Pickers who seems to be travelling well, and they need a trump behind that with a pushed along Trojan Bridge. They're followed by Art Patrick and Fair Dinkum, who seems to be going backwards. Crystal Gaze moving up on that one's inside. Newton Lodge is still at the back of the field. So they only have two fences left to go here, but there is a very long run in a cart mill. So Alpine Wind leads from Chickle McSays in second. Loxwood is back in third. They're followed by Sexton Blake. They jump the next. They're all over the okay. They need a trump trump set well, but it's Alpine Wind still the leader from Chickle McSays in second. They're followed by Loxwood and American Pickers. One more fence to go after this, and it's uh, Alpine Wind from American Pickers. He's moving forward strongly for Paul Rose. Then comes Chickle McSays. On that one's inside Sexton Blake. Loxwood is trying to run on. On the inside of Loxwood is Art Patrick. Trojan Bridge trying to get into it with Newton Lodge. They got less than three photos left to travel. Still Alpine Wind, the leader from American Pickers in second, who's coming forward to challenge strongly now. Alpine Wind looks like he's cried enough, and here comes American Pickers to pick it up for Paul Rhodes. American Pickers comes to jump the loss. It's a very long run in here in Cartmel now. American Pickers got a long way to go, and here come Loxwood, Trojan Bridge, and Jickle McSay is trying to challenge American Pickers. It's American Pickers, but Loxwood coming to pick him up now with Trojan Bridge, and he's in Inside and Chickle McSay is also running on Loxwood. Trojan Bridge trying to get to Chickle to Loxwood on the outside. Loxwood and Trojan Bridge. Loxwood is the tougher the finish. Loxwood holding on and Loxwood is going to win this for Davy Robertson from Chickle McSay in second. Trojan Bridge was third. American Pickers was fourth and Anita Tramp was back in first for Alex Cherry. So Trojan Bridge came there, looked like a winner, but he just couldn't go on with the finish, and Loxwood was much tougher in the finish. Held on gamely to win from Chickle McSay in second. Trojan Bridge third for Martin Needham. So Darren Thompson wins the Cartmel Cup handicap. American Pickers for Paul Rogers fourth and the fifth place, the new tramp Alex Trey picked up the last prize money.